Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. In this video, I will show you how to create a guard chart or speedometer chart in Excel. Guard charts are great for visually representing performance against a target. They are also known as speedometer charts because they look similar to a car speedometer. To begin, we will create the base of the guard chart using a donut chart. Follow these steps. Select the data from the range a8 to A27, go to the Insert tab, under Charts, select the Donut Chart. You will see a donut chart with 20 segments. Now adjust this chart to look like into segments from low range to high range. Remove the chart title legend, adjust the size of the chart. Select the first segment and start coloring from dark red representing the low range and gradually lighten the colors to shift to the mid range with the amber color and then to the high range by coloring with green colors like this. And then for the below portion, second semicircle, fill with no fill for the balance 10 segments. Next, we need to modify this donut chart to resemble a gauge. Further, we need to add an overlapping pie chart series. Right click on the chart and click on select data. Click on add. Select the series name as pie. Select the series range as D10 to F10. Right click on the series and click on change series chart type. Put this pie series on the secondary axis. Again, right click on this pie series and click on format data series. Set the angle of first slice as 270 degrees and the donut hole size to 0%. Using Ctrl plus right arrow, select the first slice of this series and fill with no color. Again, press Ctrl plus right arrow to select the second slice and fill with some contrasting color, say black color, so that it stands out as a needle. Ctrl plus right arrow, again fill with no color for the third slice. If you want to improve the needle, you can add the border to the second slice of the series. Now that both the donut chart and the needle are in place, format them for better visualization. Remember that the D D10 cell is linked with the actual progress figure. You can customize the gauge to fit your needs by adjusting the ranges, needle value and even adding data labels. This makes your guard chart more informative and visually appealing. And there you have it, a guard chart or speedometer chart in Excel, made easy. You can use this chart to track progress towards a target, making it a great tool for dashboards and performance reports. If you found this tutorial helpful, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe for more Excel tips and tricks. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.